Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, Remy Jade Astrology. And today, I just want to say thank you for coming back to my channel and watching this video. I know I haven't been on, um, just a few life updates. I had a new job and it took me time to adjust with like my YouTube scheduling and that's why I haven't been filming. Two, I had other goals that I needed to focus on and I was trying to focus on myself as well. Uh, I also wasn't on really social media because I was a bit burnt out from my new job and adjusting and just life in general. And then I got COVID, so that's out of the bag. Um, so I've been recovering for that, but I'm here and I'm ready to make new videos for you guys. I wanna thank everybody who has been subscribing, who still subscribed because I haven't been on my channel for a while. And I just wanna thank you for, you know, still hanging in there since I've been gone. Um, I just wanna say um, I couldn't make it without you guys. So thank you so much and stay tuned for more videos. Now on to the topic of today's video, uh, which is the Capricorn man and the Leo woman compatibility. So the elements, the Capricorn man is ruled by cardinal earth and then the Leo woman is ruled by fixed fire. So when I think about this compatibility, I think about in the natural realm, hot coal, and that's basically what it is. The coal would be, the Capricorn man, and then what brings the heat is the Leo woman. Anything other than that, I wouldn't think so. Honestly, I don't know how these two people would come together. It has to be by fate. Uh, when it comes to friendship and romantic relationship, these two people as friends are okay, but they're not gonna be calling one another to go hang out. The Capricorn man, um, needs to do things to have all of his ducks in a row and the leo woman uh is the type who is the life of the party and wants to go out so before the capricorn man would actually go out with the uh, leo woman he has to make sure whatever he was doing prior is already set rather than just going out on a whim um but if they were to enter into a romantic relationship, these two are fairly much independent with one another. Uh, they can be together and then not be together because they can just do their own thing. How they would come together though, uh, the Capricorn man would see the Leo woman to be the most beautiful of them all. Uh, they like best things in life and they strive to be the best and to get the best. They are the goat, so pretend a goat, I mean imagine a goat going up the mountain and trying to reach up to the top where whatever's up on the top would be the Leo woman. The Leo woman loves the fact that um, the Capricorn man is ambitious, so she also sees that as a way to, you know, make her feel the best as well. So they kind of are kind of like a power couple in that sense, not in generally throughout the relationship, but when it comes to like achieving things, uh, they can go really far. When it comes to fights and arguments, um, they're gonna be very explosive. The Leo woman guarantee would be super loud and pointing out, what the Capricorn man did wrong and then the Capricorn man would does not does not want to be um, Put under or put down by the Leo woman. So Best belief he would try and roar back as well. So it would be very Explosive if it's not explosive. It would be totally distant and it's like it never existed and everything is just swept under the rug. And over time, it's gonna be piled up and piled up and piled up to where it's gonna to be too big of an issue and it's just gonna to be too much. And eventually it would like possibly break up the relationship. Um, when it comes to resolving issues, uh, generally who would say sorry would be the Leo woman just because she's the one who's more communicative uh, than the uh, Capricorn man. She kind of doesn't like um, doing the silent treatment. She kind of just wants to get it over with. So, And when the Capricorn man sees that, he would most likely just go along with it and then just solve like the problem. But then again, 
they are the type of couple who just brushes it off on the you know on their shoulder and just doesn't deal with it until it gets too big when it comes to sexual compatibility though they are great in the bedroom uh since the capricorn man has a lot of built-up tension inside and he doesn't really have that outgoing personality to where like you know he shows off his like uh, macho side uh, he exudes that in the bedroom and the Leo woman likes that the Leo woman her herself is very you know uh, dramatic in the bedroom and the Capricorn man could um, complement that in the bedroom so it's very steamy very uh, you know interactive and knowing the Capricorn man he can go on for hours when it comes to recreation and um dates these are this type of couple is usually the couple that goes out for nice fine dining and also looking out at nice sceneries uh they are not the general couple that goes out to like parties or like clubs or um large big get-togethers because the capricorn man is kind of like uh very to himself the only person the only reason why they would be there would be because of the leo woman because she wants the attention other than that they would be okay with like small gatherings like intimate like probably like six six people generally um and they like to be outdoors not like hiking but like outdoors to see like the nice beach to see like a nice sunset um the leo woman likes that romantic stuff and the capricorn man likes to be outdoors since he is an earth sign so that's the type of recreational dates that they would go on last but not least what i rate this uh compatibility honestly i would give it a one out of three stars just because eventually at the end they will see a lot of differences between one another and they just don't have anything uh that they can you know solidify the capricorn man uh uh, needs before he really commits he needs to have all his ducks in a row and make sure he has uh the nice job make sure he um did all the things that he wanted to do and the leo woman uh is a type of person that wants somebody who is already ready uh to support her so eventually um this is just sun signs but eventually there's going to be a time where they're going to have a conversation on where this is going so i'm not saying that it can't work i'm just saying there's going to be a lot of obstacles when it comes to this pairing well this is my video on compatibility between the capricorn man and the leo woman thank you guys for watching and i'm going to be making more compatibility videos and i do have a list of all your requests from all of last year so thank you so much and stay tuned bye guys